वेलकम टू किंगडम एंड ग्लोरी ऑफ गाड गाड हैज कॉल्ड यू टू ऑप्टेन हिज किंगडम एंड ग्लोरी व्हाट्स द मीनिंग ऑफ द किंगडम ऑफ गाड इट इज द गवर्नमेंट ऑफ गाड इट इज अ रेन ऑफ गाड और रूल ऑफ गाड फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल ए पर्सन डिनाइज हिज सेल्फ रूल एक्सेप्ट द लॉर्डशिप ऑफ जीसस क्राइस्ट and returns to the rule of god then he is in the kingdom of god the kingdom of god is in him and now he himself is the kingdom of god secondly when christ returns to this earth the entire rule of this world authorities lordships and power will be removed then the government of this earth will be handed over to god the father Jesus Christ will renew the face of this earth and reigns over the earth for a thousand years. From here onwards, kingdom of God will be literally manifested on this earth. After his thousand years of reign over this world, the present earth and heaven will be removed and a new earth and heaven will be established by the Lord. then the lord will establish a holy city the new jerusalem which is eternal whose builder and maker is god himself god and people those who have been redeemed from all ages will reign together in the new city of jerusalem here is the beginning of the eternal kingdom of god yes God called you to obtain this eternal kingdom. The Lord has not only called you to receive the eternal kingdom but also to receive his glory. What's the meaning of the glory of God? In the history of the Bible, when God made himself comprehensible to the senses of a person, that manifestation of the presence of god is known as the glory of god the glory of god means the visible tangible and the audible presence of god in other words the glory of god means the fullest manifestations of god's life the glory of god means god himself The true blessings and inheritance of the child of God is not any of the riches of this present earth. The rewards which are going to be received in the heaven, positions and crowns and new names and also the mansions in the new Jerusalem, these are not the true blessings and inheritance of the child of God. The true blessings and inheritance of the child of God is God himself or his glory. All other doctrine in the Holy Bible has been revealed on the basis of these two important mysteries of God. Once again, I welcome each one of you to the kingdom and glory of God.